Welcome ladies and gentlemen to another YouTube tutorial brought to you by Dio. Um, this time we're going to have a little look at Discord and how you can set up your voice activation and your attenuation settings so that you can make your ga game and communication and socializing more comfortable for you and for people who you're gaming with. Because as you know, Discord has got voice channels so we can sit in there we can chat and we can carry on whilst we are playing the game um, and there's just a couple of things like maybe maybe you're thinking maybe somebody said to you gosh you can hear your key presses behind you know for, for in between you know people talking or I can hear the background music or I can hear the background noise so you know maybe you're a little bit self-conscious or and want to turn that stuff down or maybe you know you've been actually sent this video in a private message saying can you sort out your voice activation settings please because it's a little bit distracting from the game so here we go to sort these out you go to user settings okay inside user settings you will see voice and video okay and here we have it um, all this stuff is you set that up because we can hear you um, input mode voice activity okay so that requires your voice to activate as you can see, I'm speaking into into the microphone, and it's going. This is green, so anything below the green it will be silent, and anything on the on the yellow is heard. So that's voice activity. Or you can go push to talk, which means you know you have to press a key for your voice to come through. Now sometimes push to talk may be called for. Like let's say you've got crazy stuff going on in the background and you don't want that to come through or you've got dogs carrying on or something and maybe you need to take some time set up the push to talk just so you can um, switch to that in an emergency. But we're going to focus on voice activity or yeah voice activity. So I've got a lovely Razer um, Black Widow Tournament Edition okay and it's got the, the awesome clicks. Yeah. So as you can see, the clicking is making the um, is making it go into the yellow. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry if you can hear this coming through in the video, and it's quite annoying because this is what sometimes people can hear when they're playing the game. So to sort that, we just simply move this little bar further along to the right. So we move it along until it's no longer coming through. It still comes through sometimes. So we can move it along a little bit more. It still come through a couple of times there, so we move it along a little bit more. It's still coming through a little bit, so we'll move it along a little bit more. Nice. So I think we've got it set up so that at least key presses are normal key presses okay sometimes you're going to you know slam and it's going to come through the sound or something like that but at least normal key presses aren't going to come through which is going to save a lot of people the the key presses so that's how you sort that out you can take in steps as i just did or you can put it straight up to minus 48 to minus 46 and that will guarantee you if you've got a razor black widow that will guarantee you don't get the noise through the other thing that you can do is if you've got a few spare pounds you can pop to amazon and you can buy something called you know rubber o-rings for to put under your keys i did this with my with my black widow because i you know doing streaming and stuff like that so all you have to do is you buy a packet of them you lift up your keys you put one of them under and you put it back on and it reduces your noise quite significantly so that's that's another option for you to think about to get rid of the background noise from your keyboard the other thing i was hoping to help you out with set up is attenuation okay so we scroll down even more 
and you'll see that attenuation lower the volume of other applications by this percent when someone is speaking set to zero to completely disable this this function okay so what it means is every time somebody speaks into discord it knocks the volume down by 80 percent oh i've got 173 percent so it, it it near enough mutes the game so that i can hear what people are saying so if we're chatting you know i'm playing the game and getting engrossed in the game but when somebody speaks or when the, somebody else's microphone activates it pretty much mutes the game so i can hear so we can chat and then it's the same when i speak so when i speak it pretty much mutes the game so that you know so that i can hear myself speak so it doesn't get a lot of distracting so if you want to set that up that's another thing that i highly recommend but that does mean that um that you have to make sure that both your um, voice activation settings and the people in your Discord's voice activation settings are pretty much spot on because if if all you're getting is people clicking keys then instead of hearing the game all you're going to hear is and it's not very much fun so that's that's another thing that I would try and get set up. And yes, so I got when I when when I speak, when others speak, and then that's you. If you set these two things up, then people will have very pleasant experience chatting and um, listening to each other in your Discord. So thank you very much for watching, and I hope these help.